Hi, I'm Kevin Harrington. This is The Big Pitch. Industry trade shows are the true incubators of consumer product innovation. The Big Pitch recently traveled to the Surf Expo, the largest board sports and beach resort lifestyle trade show in the world. Kevin Harrington, an original shark on the hit TV show Shark Tank, is a deal maker, celebrity, and industry professional who has identified and helped launch over 500 products with over $4 billion in direct to consumer sales. Kevin and the Big Pitch team hit the Surf Expo floor and set their sights on inventors and exhibitors who might be sitting on the next big thing. Direct from the Surf Expo in Orlando, stay tuned and find out how you can get your hands on any of these top products from the Big Pitch. Chad Sandiford, welcome to the Big Pitch, your company Sandiford Enterprises, appropriately named, and uh, give us your Big Pitch. What if I told you that I have here something that can make any skater feel like Marty McFly on his hoverboard. I present to you third kind skateboard lights, a durable light kit that easily mounts to any skateboard, military grade, water resistant, micro USB rechargeable so you don't have to take them off your board and mess with expensive batteries. More than that, it lasts up to 10 hours so you can ride throughout the night. But even more profound, Third kind skateboard lights have been seen on a rider from up to a mile away. This makes them highly visible in traffic and other pedestrians. Skater designed to be rugged, rechargeable, water resistant, and lightweight. Third kind skateboard lights are a great accessory that easily mount to any skateboard, giving any rider the feel of riding a hoverboard. At night, it'll put out a glow five or six foot diameter. So it puts a lot of, puts a lot of light out there. LEDs are all the rage. It makes, I mean, it makes sense that the, for the design element alone, it just kind of cools up the factor. Kids love LEDs, too. Mm -hmm. I see kids break their neck all the time when I'm cruising by, like, mm -hmm. what in the world was that? Mm -hmm. How far along are you in building this business out? We're two and a half years in, um, and what we did at first, because I don't have the money to just go, oh, I got this idea and build it. Um, I started with initial beta test of 2,000 units. Every customer got my phone number. Uh, my partner and I drove around Florida in my pickup truck, sleeping in it, under it, wherever, getting out to the shops. Um, and we sold upwards of 1,300 of those units. The others we used for testing and that. Um, took that, recreated this model. It just arrived. We've done $41,000 in sales. 25% of that have been the website. And we've sold to more than 15 countries. Have you been thinking about selling to any of the other retailers? What I do when I'm leaving here, I'm taking my truck and trailer two weeks around Florida, another three weeks up the East Coast, and then I'm going to spend the rest of the year in California just walking into shops. Because when I walk it's a, in, it's they a unique just... market and it's hard yeah. to get down to those little accounts. And that's the challenge yeah. with this market. I, I yeah. did another product that carried a skateboard a long time ago. and. It's, well, you, it's unique. You got some good sure. retailers, the Zoomies, yeah. the Tillies, etc. You know. Last question I have is production. Do you have any constraints on production? We don't. I actually talked to my manufacturer, and they told me unlimited. I was like, "What does that mean? A hundred thousand units? A million units?" He goes, "If we make the steel molding, we can do a million a week. Oh, oh. So we can." There you go. Great, uh, great product. I hope the patents uh, come through for you. Good luck, man. Thank Thanks you, for thank coming. Thank you. Here. Pleasure. Okay. So my family and I are avid longboarders. Love to take the longboards out, and there's this little ice cream shop that's about a mile from our house, and we skateboard down there after dinner. The problem is, coming back, it's always in the dark. And coming back in the dark on a skateboard is a real challenge. My kids and I have been known to use our cell phones and uh, have that little light on like this and try and see the ground as you're whizzing along on your skateboard. Really not the best idea. Third kind skateboard lights has changed all that. Look at this, it's beautiful. The lighting actually adheres right to the underside of your skateboard. You can put it as a solid color and there's all different kinds of colors. There's red, there's green, there's blue, there's white. Or you can make it alternate colors, kind of flash to different uh, color schemes as you see happening right here. The strip itself is very long. So if you have a long board, then you could use the entire strip. But as you see here, this is a shorter skateboard. You can actually trim your lighting strip. Right here, all these little LEDs have copper connectors in the middle. And as long as you cut right where that copper connector is, there's one about every inch, then you can trim it to whatever length you want and you won't affect the operation. It's rechargeable, which I love. I'm not having to change out batteries. And they give you the charging cable 
cable right here. It's just a little micro USB cord. It's your time. Go to TheBigPitchTV.com now. Each of these products is available for a limited time at incredible prices. Brought to you by The Big Pitch and the Surf Expo.